Hi guys, how you doing? Um, this is Matthew. Uh, uh, it's been a long time since my last video. Um, I think it's September my last video. Um, I think I was cutting out some foam parts and stuff, and I like a Iron Man helmet and um, just basically how to make an helmet. Um, so, it's been eight months since my last video, and what have I been up to? I've been making up Iron Man suit. So let's take it up and look at it. Okay, here it is. Eight months of work this has taken, and we have a full-size Iron Man suit. Um, it's currently for sale. I've got it on Facebook, Marketplace, eBay, Gumtree, usual places. Um, so this is the spec. Uh, size 10 shoe. We have a 30 to 32 inch leg, 36 inch weight, waist, 46 to 48 8 inch chest and a head. Uh, it fits me, so it's a big head. Um, it is basically a standard size Iron Man suit. Uh, made from EVA foam. So it's nice. Nice and soft at the moment. Um, I don't think I have heat, sent, heat sealed these. I might have done, actually. Is that? Yeah. So, we're in the process now of oh, selling it. If I can't sell it, then I'll finish it. That's basically where I am at the moment. And, you know, it's good. It's robust, it's foam. You can't get one more robust than foam. You know, you know, it, it can, it, you can take some knocks in this and it still retains its shape. So, this is it. We've got feet, we've got the shins, the knees, the thighs, the groin, the stomach, the chest, the sh forearms, biceps, shoulders, back. I'll show you the back. All right, let's get this out of the way. One chest out of the way. Abs. Let's get some pillows, because I'm propping it up with some pillows. And ah, some more pillows. More cushions. Uh, groin area. And this is the back, which took me about six weeks to make. It was a pain in the ass. Excuse me, but it was, and this is the back. Lots of good detail. Little bit. Just made it, really. Flies. There's the flies. Got a little bit of a burn on there. Eh, yeah, don't matter. Um, Shoulder. That's about it, I think. Shin. Test that. Um, anything else I can show you? I don't think there is. So. Yeah. I'll give you an update on this, whether we're going to actually complete it or it actually gets sold uh cheers guys i'll see you on the next video okay here it is eight months of work this has taken and we have a full-size iron man suit um it's currently for sale i've got it on facebook marketplace ebay gumtree 
usual places. Um, so this is the spec. Uh, size 10 shoe. We have a 30 to 32 inch leg, 36 inch weight, waist, 46 to 48 eight inch chest and a head. Uh, it fits me, so it's a big head. Um, this is basically a standard size Iron Man suit. Uh, made from EVA foam. So it's nice. Nice and soft at the moment. Um, I don't think I have heat, sent, heat sealed these. I might have done actually. So, yeah. So we're in the process now of oh, selling it. If I can't sell it, then I'll finish it. That's basically where I am at the moment. And you know, it's good. It's robust. It's foam. You can't get one more robust than foam. And it's, you know, it it can. It, you can take some knocks in this and it still retains its shape. So, this is it. We've got feet, we've got the shins, the knees, the thighs, the groin, the stomach, the chest, the sh forearms, biceps, shoulders, back. I'll show you the back. Right, let's get this out of the way. One chest out of the way. Abs. Let's get some pillows because I'm propping it up with some pillows. Ah, some more pillows. More cushions. Uh, groin area. And this is the back, which took me about six weeks to make. It was a pain in the ass. Excuse me, but it was, and this is the back. Lots of good detail. Do the back. Play it, ready? Thighs. There's the thighs. Got a little bit of a burn on there. Eh, yeah, don't matter. Um, Shoulder. That's about it, I think. Shin. So that's that. Um, anything else to show you? I don't think there is. So. Yeah. I'll give you an update on this, whether we're gonna actually complete it or it actually gets sold uh cheers guys i'll see you on the next video okay so that's what i've been up to for the last eight months or so uh modeling um uh, i don't know how i can break this to you but i quit modeling about two years ago um work just got so busy um, I had no time for modelling at all, and I sold my stuff, everything, paints, brushes, airbrush, compressor, um, god look at that, I get a lot of shine off my head at the moment, excuse me, I have to start wearing a cap, um, so yeah, uh, things are settling down a lot now, uh, as you see, I build an Ironman suit, uh, all I've been doing is about half an hour in the morning, um, doing a bit in my tea break, lunch break, cutting out templates, cutting out foam, um, bit of gluing on Saturday morning, on a Sunday morning, um, and it, time consuming, that's what it is, just constant time consuming and 
that's why I'm selling it. That's why I'm selling the suit. It just uh, took me eight months of my time and I want to go back to modeling. So it was my birthday a couple of weeks ago and uh, my wife said, what would you like? And I said, can I have a new paint box? So she got me a paint box and some paints and I've got some brushes and a noisy dog. Don't you dare. Um, so we're going to get back into some modeling again soon. Um, some cars, some figures, some airplanes. I'm going to just basically build what I want. Um, I did have a um, Facebook page where I was making models to order and people were just asking for the same stuff all the time. Batman, Joker, Batman, Joker, 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 Joker. Um, so I just had enough. But now I'm going back. So, there's models to come. Stay with me. Please, you don't have to like or subscribe or anything. But if you feel that you need to, just do it. Um, I'll let you know how I get on with my new paint box. As and when. And I'll see you very soon. Cheers, guys.